Hi, I'm Laura Campbell from Baby Ladies and I'm going to be giving you some tips on how to look after your newborn and how to achieve the birth that you want. So parents being home and newborn are often quite frightened about the first bath and it really doesn't need to be frightening, it should be a lovely experience for all of you. And for the first few days, you really don't need to bath baby. You can just use a sponge or some cotton wool and some warm water. But if you do feel that you want to take the plum and, uh, and give them a bath, then um, a good start is the sink because it's obviously quite a small space and you can, uh, you can get, get confident about bathing baby. So um, make sure you give the sink a nice, uh, nice clean with products that aren't too strong or full of chemicals. So Milton wipes are really good for sterilising the, the area and you know there's nothing in there that can hurt baby. So I'm just going to fill the sink with some nice hand hot water. Just a tiny bit in there, baby's not going for a swim, it's just to get the feeling and the experience of having a bath and to get them into a, a routine and, and, and enjoying that bath time routine because it's a special time. So you can put some um, something very, very uh, mild in there without chemicals, so I'm going to put a bit of the um, Arbon uh, hair and body wash and I'm literally going to put a tiny wee drop and I'm going to foam that up. So have everything nice and prepared, so you've got your towel, you've got your clean nappy and you've got your baby grows, the baby's going to go in after her nice warm bath. And we're going to go and get baby now. Hello baby. This obviously is a doll. <laughs> and I'm just going to hold baby under her armpit and just reassure her, look at the lovely water, isn't it lovely? And I'm just going to sprinkle the water over her. This is more about the experience than an actual clean up. She's not been down the gym for an hour. I'm just going to sprinkle the water over her. And I'm just going to run the baby sponge under her neck because little bits of milk can get caught underneath the neck. And just give her a little sponge down, a little clean between her legs. And then I'm going to use a separate sponge for her face clean around her mouth and her head and that's enough so now we're going to put her carrier out of the sink and pop her in her nice warm towel and these hooded towels are great and we're just going to wrap her up and give her a lovely cuddle